How many times have you started piecing motifs for a pattern together, only to realise that you wish you'd drawn something slightly larger, maybe added an extra leaf to a flower stalk, or drawn it at a different angle? This used to happen to me all the time, and I got so fed up with having to redraw motifs that I decided it was time to turn my pattern design workflow on its head. I'm Becky Flaherty, an illustrator and surface pattern designer based here in the UK. I'm so excited to be teaching this class here on Skillshare because this is where I got started in my career in surface pattern design and learn how to make patterns. I now sell my designs on sites like Redbubble, Society6 and Spoonflower, as well as doing freelance work for both small and large businesses. In this class, I'm gonna teach you how I make my patterns with a built-in half drop, how to sketch out the entire pattern tile, working out the technical repeat before you spend any time illustrating motifs. I'll teach you how to set up your canvas in Procreate so that it works almost like a pattern preview. You'll be able to see the edges of the repeat and how it matches up with the next tile as you are drawing. I've aimed this class at more seasoned pattern designers who are looking to learn how to make a half drop or want to pick up a few tips to speed up their workflow. And this class isn't just for digital artists. I actually still use this workflow if I'm going to be painting the motifs for a pattern in watercolour or gouache. For a recent freelance project with a really tight deadline, I use this exact method to be able to give the client a preview of the pattern and layout and colours, and we were able to very quickly make adjustments without me having to pick up a paintbrush. And then when I came to create the motifs, I could trace them using a light box, knowing that they were going to fit together perfectly when I brought them together on the computer. Once you're familiar with this method, you can very quickly create patterns which you can use directly from Procreate, uploading to sites like Redbubble or Spoonflower, or if you wanted to make further edits in Photoshop, that's an option too. After taking this class, you will have a really useful workflow in your toolkit for creating smooth and flowing seamless patterns directly in Procreate, anytime, any place, using this super easy built-in half drop method. I hope you're as excited as I am to get started, and I will see you in class.